Okay, so welcome to Math Storia na Lisa Bistapi. Finding the derivative of trigonometric functions. So for the derivative of sin u, that's cosine u times the derivative of u. So if we have this given, y equals sin 3x. So on this given, u equals 3x. And for the derivative of u or the derivative of 3x, that's 3. So to find now the derivative of this given, since the derivative of sine is cosine, so we have cosine 3x times the derivative of u, that's 3. So therefore, y prime is equal to 3 times cosine 3x. Then for this given, so y equals 4 times sine 2x minus 1. So for this given, u equals 2x minus 1. And to find the derivative of u, since the derivative of 2x is 2 and the derivative of 1 is 0, so du is equal to 2. So to find now the derivative of this given, so we have 4 and for sine, that's cosine, so times cosine 2x minus 1 times du, that's 2. So y prime equals, so this 4 times 2, that's 8, then times cosine 2x minus 1. Then for the derivative of cosine, that's negative sine u times du. So if we have y equals cosine 5x, so for this given, u equals 5x. And for the derivative of u, that's 5. So to find now the derivative of this given, since the derivative of cosine is negative sine, so we have negative sine 5x times du and du is 5. So therefore y prime is equal to negative 5 times sine 5x. Then for this y equals 2, then cosine 3x plus 4. So on this given u equals 3x plus 4. And to find the derivative of u, since the derivative of 3x is 3 and the derivative of 4 is 0, so du is equal to 3. So to find now the derivative of this even, so we have 2 times, since the derivative of cosine is negative sine, so minus sine, then 3x plus 4 times the derivative of u, that's 3. So y prime equals 2 times negative 1, that's negative 2. And negative 2 times 3, that's negative 6. Then sine 3x plus 4. Then for the derivative of tangent u, that's second squared u times du. So if we have y equals tangent 4x, so for this given, u equals 4x. And for the derivative of u, that's 4. So to find now the derivative, since tangent is second squared u, so we have second squared 4x times the derivative of u. So y prime is equal to 4 times second squared 4x. Then for y equals 2 tangent 3x squared. So for this given, u equals 3x squared. And to find the derivative of u, so the derivative of 3x to the power 2 using the power rule, 
So 3 times 2, that's 6. Then minus 1 for the exponent, that's x. So du is equal to 6x. So to find out the derivative, so we have 2 times second squared 3x squared times the derivative of u, that's 6x. So y prime equals this 2 times 6x, that's 12x, then second squared 3x to the power 2. Then for the derivative of cotangent u, that's negative cosecant squared u times du. So if we have y equals 6 cotangent 4x, so for this given, u equals 4x, and for the derivative of u, that's 4. So to find out the derivative, so we have this 6 times the derivative of cotangent, that's negative cosecant squared 4x times the derivative of u, that's 4. Then y prime equals, so this 6 times negative 1, that's negative 6, and negative 6 times 4, that's negative 24, then cosecant squared 4x. Then if we have this given, so y equals negative 2, then cotangent 6x plus 5. So for this given, u equals 6x plus 5. And for the derivative of u, since the derivative of 6x, that's 6, and the derivative of 5, that's 0, so du is equal to 6. So to find out the derivative, so we have negative 2 times negative cosecant u or cosecant 6x plus 5 times the derivative of u, that's 6. So y prime equals negative 2 times negative 1, that's positive 2, and positive 2 times 6, that's positive 12. Then we have this cosecant squared times 6x plus 5. Then for the derivative of second u, that's second u times tangent u times the derivative of u. So if we have y equals second 7x, so on this given u equals 7x and du is 7. So to find out the derivative, so we have this second 7x times tangent 7x times the derivative of u, that's 7. So y prime is equal to 7 times second 7x and tangent 7x. Then for this given, so we have y equals 5 times second uh, 2x squared minus 1. So on this given, u equals 2x squared minus 1. And to find the derivative of u, so since the derivative of 2x to the power 2, this one is 4x. And the derivative of negative 1, this one is 0. So du is equal to 4x. So to find out the derivative, so we have 5 times the derivative of second u. That's second 2x squared minus 1 times tangent 2x squared minus 1 times du. And du is... 4x. Then y prime equals so this 5 times 4x, that's 20x. Then second 2x squared minus 1 times tangent 2x squared minus 1. Then for this derivative of cosecant u, 
that's negative cosecant u times cotangent u times the du. So if we have y equals cosecant 9x, so to find the derivative, so on this given, u equals 9x and du, that's 9. So we have now y prime equals negative cosecant 9x times cotangent 9x times the derivative of u, that's 9. So y prime equals negative 9, then cosecant 9x cotangent 9x. Then for this y equals 7 cosecant 6x plus 2. So on this given, u equals 6x plus 2. And for the derivative of u, so derivative of 6x, that's 6. The derivative of 2, that's 0. So du is equal to 6. So to find out the derivative, so we have this 7 times this negative cosecant 6x plus 2 times tangent 6x plus 2 times the derivative of u, that's 6. So y prime equals, so this 7 times negative 1, that's negative 7. And negative 7 times 6, that's negative 42. Then times cosecant, 6x plus 2. Then tangent, 6x plus 2. Then if we have this given, y equals sine 5x minus 1 plus tangent 6x plus 3. So to find the derivative, so for this term, u equals 5x minus 1. And to find the derivative of u, this one is 5. And for this term, u equals 6x plus 3. So to find the derivative, that's 6. Then to find the derivative, since the derivative of sine is cosine, then 5x minus 1 times the derivative of u, that's 5. Then plus the derivative of tangent, that second squared 6x plus 3 times the derivative of u, that's 6. So therefore, we have this 5, then cosine, 5x minus 1 plus 6 second squared 6x plus 3. Then if we have this given, y equals 5, then cosine 3x to the power 2 minus 4 cosecant 7x. So for this term, u equals 3x to the power 2 and the derivative of u. Since the derivative of 3x to the power 2, that's 6x. Then for this term, so u equals 7x and the derivative of u, that's 7. So to find now the derivative, so since the derivative of cosine is negative sine, so we have 5 times negative sine 3x to the power 2 times the derivative of u that 6x then minus and for the derivative of cosecant that's negative cosecant u times cotangent u so we have this 4 times negative cosecant 7x times cotangent 7x times the derivative of u that's 7. So we have now y prime is equal to 5 times negative 1. That's negative 5. And negative 5 times 6x. 
that's negative 30x, then sine 3x to the power 2. Then for this negative 4 times negative 1, that's positive 4. And positive 4 times 7, that's positive 28. So plus 28. Then this cosecant 7x and cotangent 7x.